A quantity of 19.50 ml of a KOH solution is needed to neutralize 0.4 grams of KHP. What is the concentration in molarity of the KOH solution? We are also given here the balance reaction or the neutralization reaction between KHP and NaOH. So the first step you're going to do in this problem is to solve for the moles of KHP. Now in the problem, we are given 0 0.4 grams of KHP. So we start with that. And although it's not given in the problem, you can actually look for the molar mass of KHP, or you can solve for the molar mass of KHP. Um, KHP, remember, that's not potassium, hydrogen, and phosphorus. KHP is just an abbreviation for potassium hydrogen phthalate. Okay, so for KHP, its molar mass is 204.22 grams per mole. So... One mole of KHP is equivalent to 204.22 grams of KHP. So the grams of KHP would cancel out. And this will now give you moles of KHP. And now looking at the balance equation, you can see there that for every one mole of KHP, it reacts with one mole of NaOH. So the molar ratio is 1 is to 1. So you write it in your next conversion factor. 1 mole of KHP reacts with 1 mole of NaOH. So the moles of KHP would cancel out. And now you have the moles of NaOH. So if you solve this in your calculator, 0 0.4 times 1 divided by 204.22 times 1 divided by 1, you will get approximately 1.959 times 10 to the negative 3, and this is moles of NaOH. Okay, now that you have the moles of NaOH, you can now solve for the concentration concentration or the molarity of the KOH solution. So remember the formula for molarity. Molarity is moles of solute, in this case NaOH, divided by liters of solution. So the moles we got was 1.959 times 10 to the negative 3 moles divided by the liters of solution in the problem we are given 19.50 ml so you need to convert that first to liters so 19.50 ml to liters you simply divide it by a thousand so 19.50 19 divided by 1000 that is 0 0.0195 and that's liters so if you solve that 1.959 times 10 to the negative 3 divided by 0 0.0195, you will get approximately 0 0.100 moles per liter or 0 0.100 molar. And this is the answer to the question.